So this feels a little bit like cheating because we already have Philips Hughes lights in our house. But during CES, we stopped by the Google Gumball and on top of meeting in that giant line, putting our coin in and asking Google our question, we got a prize. And I'm not talking about the Google Assistant beanie. No, we got Philips Hughes lights. Now this starter pack is pretty straightforward. Like I said, we've had it before. It comes with a bridge and four bulbs, but let's bust this box open and I can showcase what's inside. Boom, boom. So this right here is the bridge. Without this bad boy, you are not able to control your bulbs. Unlike the Spangled Home, which we talked about earlier, uh, where you can just connect them directly to the app and directly to your Wi-Fi, because this is designed for, you know, one point of interest on its own Wi-Fi system for all the bulbs, this device actually connects to all of them and allows an easier and faster use for controlling the hub. Uh, on top of that, we have our four bulbs. They look pretty similar to your regular light bulbs, the cheap ones. They do, of course, have the, the Philips Hue, and they, they're a little bit shinier in this area. But there's really nothing that stands out primarily about these that makes them unique. They're not even the color bulbs. These are just the white ones. But if you're looking for a, a real quick and easy way to change a bunch of your bulbs in your house, the Philips Hue system is pretty straightforward. You can set up multiple of the devices at the exact same time. You can really allow a lot of options for your house. Like for instance, in our kitchen, we have two light bulbs that have four bulbs in them. So we actually bought one, like four bulbs and we basically swapped out both of them. So now whenever we turn off one switch, it automatically turns off the two bulbs. They're automatically synced together with the digitally in the app. And then the other one is the same exact way. This gives you that opportunity. <laughs> now you have some really cool features on here. Uh, you have to force the, the wall socket plug, pretty straightforward. This little plug goes into there. You need that to work. And then this plugs into your router. So you need this, but forget about that. This is all about these bad boys because these are the thing that makes it work. Now with this bridge, you can pick up some color bulbs and work. This, you don't need to have a color bridge or a white bridge. There's no real difference. But with the Hue and the Google Assistant, you can use your Google Home to set up your lights to turn on. You can set up specific groups. You can do so much with both Hue and Google. Because of their partnership, you can connect other devices to them and make a lot of really cool features. This allows you to group, manage, adjust the lighting, even set specific times of day you want the lights to go on automatically. So if you want your room to wake you up as opposed to your phone with your alarm or alarm clock, you can do that with your lights. However, I will warn you, if you wear a sleep mask, that will not work. Really cool things you can do with this though, is you can set up with Google Home specifically to say things like, hey, turn on the living room lights and it'll turn on the, one, the lights in the living room. Or you can basically group together multiple things, like turn on um, like the west wing of the house, and it will turn on every light on the what you've denoted as the west wing of the house in these really cool groups. So if you're looking for a easy and fast pack to pick up, give you multiple options, and you wanna make your house a little bit more smarter, a little bit more synced, definitely check out the Philips Hue, especially since they're working so well with your Google Home. Thank you guys for checking this out. We're gonna do a couple more unboxing videos down the line. We're just gonna wait a little bit to get to those points. So please make sure to check out our articles and posts on our website, as well as other videos we're posting here on YouTube. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys next time. Make sure to like and subscribe.